<laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Now this week's video is all about TTTM. That is talk 30 to me. Okay, the birthday experience. It's all about quite fair this weekend. We're at the fabulous Royal Sun, okay? And I'm here with my family, my friends, and we're gonna have an amazing weekend. So if you're interested in watching that, keep on watching. Watch excitement! <laughs> So we're gonna do a cheers, you know, just to kind of sort of open the weekend great, you know, and in the right spirit with spirits, right? I'm gonna troll. The trials, if you're listening to that, they'll clap me. If you're eating. The trials, I'm gonna troll with the outfit name. Oh my, everything turned belong for me. A chad at the saving grace right now. So if you're listening to it tonight, comment and clap me. <laughs> comment and clap me. I'm gonna go through it with the outfit name. And then tail at the middle of the night, a tuckin and a thin shop. Ladies and gentlemen, Casey, this is Casey, say hi. Good evening, Jamaica. Good evening, Jamaica. <laughs> right. Chloe, say hi, wave to the camera. Hi. Here we go. Oh, we like all know Tanaya. Oh, say hi. Oh, you don't know her, Auntie Karen to you. Oh, say hi. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> This is my brother. Say hi to the camera. Hi. Period. Hello. Uncle Glenn. How are you doing? Right. I'm Auntie She flew in. Say hi. Hey guys. You know this face, celebrity mother. What does this stand up in huh? <laughs> <laughs> This is why pre white shop walk one. <laughs> it's your boy. That's my name though. <laughs> Fred, say hey. Hi. Juice, say hey. A Johnny's in the cut, say A. Hey. Say A. Hey. Hey. <laughs> this is Kevin. Hey. Say A. Hey. <laughs> Don't tell me the same shot, the same shot. You gotta be the same shot as us. Hi, yeah. This is not a shot. This is this is no you have for half this girl. You have for half this. You have for half. You're gonna shot it like that? No? Yes. 
Well, air she bought more. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. All right, all right. Yeah, guess what? No, no, look a bit more than this. And then switch them. Where me up. Yeah, yeah. So you get the less one. Casey, friend of Rohan, also kind of like co-worker. And I'm looking forward to just having a fantastic weekend with him. Just unwinding and not trying to really focus on anything else, but just making a memorable 30th birthday for him. Hi, I'm Karen, Rohan's mom. I am looking forward to a lot of fun this weekend. Hi, my name is Suzanne and I'm Rohan's aunt. Hello, my name is Glenn Campbell and I'm Rohan's uncle. What I'm expecting for the weekend is a weekend full of fun, of family, and of friendship. What am I expecting this weekend? Nothing but fun. Nothing 
my family. I am Jean. I am Rohan's grandmother. I am I'm expecting fun and laughter with my family and friends. My name is Zane Palomino. I'm Rohan's cousin. And for this weekend, it's, it's about to be a movie. We're about to get lit. That's all I know. <laughs> Hi. Hi, my name is Dominic. I am Rowan's cousin, and I'm looking for a great time and having fun with my family this weekend. My name is Chloe. Um, Rowan is literally like my brother, but not without a fight. Hi, my name is Karen. Um, some people could say Auntie Karen. Um, for Rowan, he'll say Auntie Karen, Miss Clark, Mama Jer. I don't know, that's me. My relationship with him is that I've known Rowan probably about 15 years. I met him when he reached out to me, tracked me down, got my number because he heard about the YVAs and he said he wanted to be a part of it. So he reached out and got my number and said, lady, I want to get to know you and I want to be a part of the YVAs and how can I be on a high crew? And that is how I met him and we developed a really great relationship. I literally used to fight him out because him and my mom are so close and I was, I'm an only child. So I was like, ah, oh, who are you? But only half though, because I always loved him. But um, yeah, he is my big brother that I never had. Um, he is the one who tells me to, you know, straighten up your back, girl. And that they'd beat a girl, edit them, diss me. I know he doesn't mean that. He's not a violent person. But I know he says it with love, and I love him too, I guess. <laughs> I'm looking forward to this weekend because um, he has achieved something that a lot of people haven't and that you can't buy which is surrounding yourself with really good people um, and really loving people and people are just a pleasure to be around as much as he's a pleasure to be around so I know that this weekend is going to be filled with a lot of joy and a lot of happiness and just gratefulness and that's what we're here to do and be grateful for another year and I'm just super excited so. Why pre white up all gone my name is Sings and money don't know QP is basically my older brother and my mentor, and um, yeah, he's really the greatest mentor I could have ever asked for, um, especially being so early on in the journey, on the YouTube journey. Um, I appreciate his efforts and his support along the way. Um, and yeah, this weekend is just vibes still, honestly, is me? I'm looking forward to the drinks. I've already had a few <laughs> drinks, as you can see. <laughs> but yeah, a few drinks and just good vibes energy. and good energy, you know? Good vibes, good energy. Alright, so, so I'm Johnny Hines. Yeah, QP is one of my friends, a mentor, uh, someone, in terms of a role model, someone that's been there in the entertainment. It's a support actually. system for yeah, you. Support, <laughs> you know, so, yeah, you have yeah. to have someone that's been there and done that to give you a little bit of insights of what to come. Um, in terms of entertainment for sure. and stuff. Yeah, social media and all of those stuff. Yeah. Um, for this weekend, we're looking for a good time, good energy. Um, just a chill weekend and just... Good vibes. Yeah, good vibes. <laughs> Hi, so my name is Drew Michelle and I am Perry's friend. And I'm here to help celebrate his birthday. And one major thing I'm looking forward to this weekend is just to enjoy my time here with him help to bring in that 30 vibe and just get to know people better and just celebrate his life so hi my name is chad and i'm a friend of quiet perry one of my major expectations of this weekend is really to just help him welcome in his 30s and welcome in the new the new birth year the new vibes and have a great time Hi guys, um, my name is Kevon, um, Kevon Merchant. I am Rohan's friend, um, very recent friend. I am looking forward to a great time, great energy. Well, I'm sure it will be fun because it's Rohan thing, so. So, I'm Fred, and for this weekend I'm looking forward to just a great time, um, having fun, drinking, enjoying ourselves. Um, Reliving past moments where we just party and just enjoyed ourselves because of, you know, COVID and everything. We haven't had those moments anymore. The last time we hung out was um, over a year ago. So I'm just looking forward to this weekend to reconnecting with my friend and enjoying ourselves. 
Um, my name is Romario Perry. I am the brother of the birthday boy. And for this weekend, I'm just looking for everybody to have a good time. I'm looking to spend some time with my family because it's been some time since all of us has, has um, been in the same place. And yeah, we're gonna talk 30 to Rohan this weekend, absolutely. Tanoya Wint, best friend to the birthday boy. What I'm looking forward to most is talk 30 to me. Um, so excited to spend this big milestone with Rohan. Um, known him for 10 years and you know, you've elevated so much. I'm just so proud of you. And I just know that this weekend is just going to be so awesome. You're surrounded by awesome people, people that love you so much. And we're just going to have a grand time and turn up. So happy birthday and lots of love. My name is Kadeen Perry. I am Rohan's uh, eldest, elder sister. Um, what do I expect for this weekend? In true Rohan style, frolicking and a lot of fun, food. Um, just have a, a very good time. Hi, I'm R. St. Tobin Perry, and I'm the father of R. St. Tobin Perry. Is that all right? <laughs> now, you, you do imagine why I would do that, because he's named exactly after me, except for the first name, but we stuck, we stuck to the initials. I'm just here to have a good time, um, celebrate with my son. Um, never thought I'd live to see this day. 30 is a good milestone. And I wish for him a lot, a lot, lot more. And I'm just here to have a good time with him. Hug him as much as I used to when he was a child. And take it from there. It's Tananya, Tananya Tracy, if you want to be formal. Um, everybody knows me, I run by mother from ever since, you understand? But we never could fall in out because we could have made my total things in other courts. But to say we're back together again, having a second a joke. I am Rohan's friend. I've probably known Rohan for four years now or more. Um, we were very close at one point and we're just finding our way back now. I'm actually really excited to just be in his space because I haven't been his, in his space in a capacity like this in a very long time. So I'm actually really excited to enjoy myself, to party with him, you know, just to like vibe, mesh and bond like we used to because, you know, when we come together, it's always magic. So we're getting ready for the beach broth. It is an all white affair. As I can say, it's on the beach. Um, I just came up from uh, dinner with my family. It was very intimate, very nice, very needed. Enough of them have been seen a long while. A big up to everybody who flew in. Right, I almost said flew in, but not talk from Ochi. Not talk big foreign, all right? Eh? So I'm getting ready right now. I'm a cologne in my car. Some of you have big cologne. Can you imagine for my big, big weekend? But I can't go there with a green arm. You understand? Come here, I can run up and down and sweat and... You understand? Yeah, this is the night of the birthday eve. So you know you have to do the stuffs. Right. Loving how you wind up for me. Tonight is all on me. My shop, the place for me. Yeah, yeah. She just want to highlight. Ooh, we, the body talk to me. I need a taste, baby. Loving the way, loving the way you move around me. No more delay. No, you can't wait to shut it down. Won't you show me how you work it? Quite for a TTT, I must. Can't leave without it. Party time! Falling, falling, digging. I keep falling, falling, digging. And every time that you come across my mind, I keep falling, falling, digging. I keep falling, falling, digging. In love. Wanna connect with you like Bluetooth? No touching, that's my boo boo. Your love, they do me voodoo. She's my new boo. I'm watching her like okay. you too. I wanna ride I like Choo Choo. Your love, they do me cuckoo. Hey, yeah. Loving the way, loving the way you move around me. The body don't wait. Oh my god. The first event for the weekend. Oh, we just now. I can find no flaws you 
perfect Cause every time that you come around my way yeah, I yeah, keep yeah. falling, falling big and yeah, I yeah, keep falling yeah. through My guys, the I'm standing to you Look for me, big, big, junkie My money tick like a car in down play rain With style of the vocal race Black and beautiful song Yeah, man. What do you mean, man? Perry, you don't know. Lila, I could this. Yeah, this is <laughs> Very sorry I couldn't make it. Yeah, girl, gotta travel, bro. <laughs> but yeah, I just want to wish you a very happy birthday. You're an awesome person. You give a lot of people light. I, for sure, just enjoy watching your videos and, and everything. P.S. You need to bring back the talent show, right? But I just want to say happy birthday. Sorry I couldn't make the birthday party. But I know for sure you're having a great time. We say talk 30 to me. Yeah, man. More life, more love, more prosperity. Okay? Enjoy your day. Or your night. Because I'm going to take you higher. You're my only desire. Girl, I want you break from the stress and the hate feel the loving feel the rhythm singing oh na na oh na na rohan going into his 30s i wish him all the best um, he is on a good path and I pray that it is always up up. Enter in your 30s Ron, I wish nothing but prosperity. I also wish good health and always remember to put the Lord first because he's the one who will put you through it all. Life is short, enjoy yourself. I'm praying that he gets a nice young lady and get married and settle down. Uh, one wish, uh, Rohan, just for you to keep being successful and just being a, a good family member. Uh, that's, that's oh, I was kind of going to say the same thing, just keep being you and have fun. Yeah, don't change for no one. Just to continue to be himself, you know, that's what has gotten him here this far and that's what's going to continue um, working for him. 
that's what's going to make him go the extra mile. So just continue being you, Ro. You're such a beam of light. So I think that's what the best advice I could give <laughs> for your 30th year. I guess more success and more success, said, more yeah, vibes. Just to stay focused and stay relaxed. You don't want to stress out yourself. So and the man loves to <laughs> <laughs> uh, stay calm and just go day by day. You know, just do what you have to do. Plan out your, your day and just carry it out. Do, do what you gotta do, bro. Do, stuff, yeah. do what you gotta do. Mm -hmm. You only live once, one, man. One life. You only live once. I think one of one of the wishes, maybe the most major one, would be that he draws closer to God this year. I feel like when you're 30, you're hitting a point in your life where, you know, you're getting real. Like this is 30. Like this is this decade, and you know, if God is not at the center, then nothing can really be possible. So I feel like that would be my main wish. One wish for Rohan going into his 30s is that he will get everything that he wishes for times to tenfold. Um, he's an amazing individual and he deserves everything that he wants. So I wish for that. I wish that for him. I said it to him earlier, um, the power of discernment to know what's good for you, what's bad for you, to, able to, to be able to identify the things that will do you well and the things that will not and I wish you more success, more happiness, more love, and all the good things. Um, happiness. I really, I really want him to be happy professionally, personally, just in all aspects of his life because he's, he's, worked, he's worked really hard and he really deserves it. One wish for Rohan going to his 30s. Um, hmm, more opportunities. So one wish I have for Rohan going into his 30s is definitely continued success. I am absolutely proud of the person that you are today. You are a complete visionary and I'm getting quite emotional just saying this because it's, I, I know the road that you took to get here, it wasn't easy. And I just wish you continued happiness, success, prosperity, just a lot of things coming to fruition. I wish for him to find, um, you know, happiness and that he doesn't overthink and he just, um, we have a five-year plan, you know what it is, we're not going to say it right here, but we have a plan that that comes to, to, to life. Well, I think at 30 now, um, we need to see some things change, you know, we need to see a little different drawing. Yeah. You can still have a little t time, but then I'm here. I'm, I'm, I'm looking, I'm looking probably for family and stuff like that to see, see move in that direction. But I'm not pressuring you. My one major wish for Rohan, um, I think it would be for him to get the house that he so badly wants, because I know that's really what he's working towards right now. And really, if it isn't for a material thing and it is just for anything else, it is for just peace of mind, you know, for him to just be okay with everything happening around him, everything happening within him, just for him to bring himself closer to the Lord. I don't know how much closer to the Lord he can get because he's already right beside him. But you know, just for him to walk on that journey, you know, be closer to the Lord, as I said, and just be himself even more than he already is. Yeah, no, you ain't no psycho. You're not like the others, no. No changing behaviors. Not sure how to act around you. So colorful and bright, yeah. I wanna be an artifact. You made me come alive, babe. Let's go, lazy river time. You guys already know what's going on. Lazy looking river, looking very lazy. That's it, yeah. We like it, we like it, we like it. Not too many people, no crowd. You get me? We can just go in, get a nice little float, and just go and build. You get me? Ready? Or maybe just for tonight. Do you wanna get to know me? I will give it all to you. You and me forever Don't care about nothing else Making it happen, yeah Cause you're a winner I'm not gonna fall down We're having a great time Enjoy yourself, son Happy birthday, daddy loves you 
really, really bad. Sitting right. looking like a loser, but I don't wanna lose ya. Come change my life just for a while. Let's go for a ride now. Outside the club, we come alive. Let's go for a ride. Yeah. I wanna get to know you. I don't wanna leave so soon. You want me forever, or maybe just for tonight. Do you wanna get to know me? Change my life, let's go for a ride Outside the club, we come alive, let's go for a ride yeah, yeah. I wanna get to know you, I don't wanna leave so soon You and me forever, or maybe just for tonight Do you wanna get to know me? Because we wanna, we wanna Yeah, we just wanna have fun The trunk's full of wine We're gonna stay up Have the time of our lives The night is in young Don't need anybody else We came to party all night long And we don't need no chaperone We don't need nobody's attention Yeah, we just wanna dance
Okay, so um, I want to thank you all. Okay. Aww. And? <laughs> you made it. <laughs> right. So um, thus far this weekend has. surpass my expectations and I am thankful for everybody who has attended. Um, but before we start to dine, we've all brought, we've all parted, but I want to give a special attention to someone who has played a very important role in my life, and that is God. So I want us all to just take a moment right now. Um, it's a little mini worship. Um, so in this moment, I want you guys to think about all the things we're grateful for because it has been an extraordinary time for every single person sitting at this table and we're here on the other side of it and so I just want us to just take this time before we pray and everything to just acknowledge God and this song that I'm about to play is very important to me. So, let's just take a moment to just gather ourselves and think about things that we're grateful for. Dependable, dependable God It doesn't matter what comes my way You are still God yeah. Intentional Intentional God Everything is working out for my good Dependable, dependable God It doesn't matter what comes my way You are still God yeah, yeah. Intentional, intentional, God. I would like to offer a word of prayer. So if we could just join hands. Father God, we come before you humble, grateful, and thankful, Father God, for all that you have done. Thank you for carrying us all safe, on your safety. Father God, thank you for coming us under your head. Father God, I pray a special anointing over every single person sitting here today, Father God. I bring them before you, Father God, and I offer them up for Jesus. I pray that you just cancel all attacks of the enemy against them, Father God. I pray that you help them to walk in faith and not by sight. Amen. Amen. Okay, we got you now. <laughs> I just um, remember Rowan telling me that, don't worry daddy, I'm gonna make you proud. Because you know, we always had a little man to man kind of thing. And, um, Getting up with it and you get faster, and the direction is taking and all that. And uh, when I stopped, it was when he said, Don't worry, that I'm gonna make you proud. And um, I stand here today, extremely proud of. 
what years to come. And um, to just say that I've totally lost my own identity because I mean, in my own self, I thought Richard Perry was a brand. <laughs> <laughs> Because everybody knew Richard Perry you know. Yeah. And then all of a sudden I was no longer Richard Perry. I became quite Perry's father. And I had to keep reminding people that my name was Richard Perry. I want to tell you that at 30, my son, I'm happy for what you done to the world. Um, and um, I'm just going to say, keep doing what you're doing. And I have something that I always just say to the back of my head. I think somebody said something similar to that some a couple thousand years ago. But I have to um, sort of Plagiarize And so I would say that this is my first begotten son in whom I am well pleased. All right, so as Daddy said, I also have completely lost my identity. <laughs> you're like, oh my God, you're a quiet person. Well, I'm like, no, my name is Romario. <laughs> yes, right? Yeah, so um, for years growing up, um, we were basically side by side everywhere we go, every adventure we would go on our adventures together um i remember we would ride our bicycles to the end of the the pier um we'll never i would never forget that day when i don't know we must train off on huh? with a race with a race right uh, and king pupalik <laughs> yeah shambles yeah i remember and i'll never forget our not nights growing up, uh, we would uh, spend the entire Friday night uh, playing Smash Brothers, uh, Bone Game, Bone game yeah, and Bone yeah. Game. So when I made my post this morning on Instagram, uh, I was very deliberate when I said my OG friend, because this was my best friend growing up. Uh, um, <laughs> One thing about Rohan, he knows what he wants, and he's gonna do ex absolutely everything to get there and that's something that I admire about him very much and I try to apply that in my life as well so I don't want to take this time to say I'm very proud of you you know I'm gonna tell this outside of this but I'm very proud of you <laughs> very proud of you and keep doing what you're doing keep inspiring the world and I know you will continue to place your mark on this world and Here's the 30 years and here's the 30 more. Yes. Rohan, happy birthday. My cousin, you know I look up to you. You know my goals, like you're the only one that I told my goals to for the season coming up. We got closer recently. I just wanna wish you many more birthdays. All right, that's it for me. Sure. 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 I love him, I love him. He is respectful and he's a loving person. Rohan was about five, six then. He came in and he said to me, no grandma, don't leave the shoes there because when daddy is going to flog me, this is where I run. <laughs> so, uh, uh, so <laughs> Rohan, I would like to wish you all the best in life, all the best. Right? Just keep on what you're doing and all will be well. Thank you. <laughs> Good evening, everyone. 
Good evening. I am quite Perry's mother. <laughs> Not Karen Perry. He turned everything around to us. Let us reflect. Right? It, it, it wasn't about him. That is how he is. Right? Very caring, nurturing, individual. Right? Um, very ambitious. He sets his goals and he tries to achieve it. A very hard thinker. Sometimes I think he thinks too much. But here is the end result. Son, I am so proud of you. Just like his dad, we often wonder, I leave in the morning, Ron is in the bed. I come home in the evening, Ron is in the bed. I move back and forth, Ron is in the bed. So Ron, you're not gonna find one work. You cannot stay like this. But look at him now. Son, I wish you all the best. I pray that the Lord will cover you. All your dreams come true and continue doing what you're doing. Up, up. I'm the eldest. Um, so essentially, Rohan has been my, my first friend because we're, it's, Technically four days shy of two years. We're born the same month, November, the best month that is. What I like, what I like about Rohan, what I love about Rohan is that he's very intentional about what he's doing. And I admire that about him because when he puts his mind to something, like it's, it's going to come true. When he said that he's gonna drop out of UTEC, we were all worrying like, okay, what are you going to do now? Like, you know, mom and dad are worried like he's not gonna make anything of himself, but he was adamant that this is the road that he wants to take. And I'm so happy that he stood his ground and actually just went ahead with it because when I, see, when I go out there and I see Quiet Perry, I'm just so proud. I'm just so happy that you have, you have done this with your life. And I just want to wish you all the best um, in everything that is to come and that you, know, you continue to you know, keep God close. I wish you a very happy birthday and I know that you will definitely, definitely make the best out of everything. And I love you. Oh, love you. Rohan, my cousin, <laughs> I'm proud of you for where you started and where you are now and where you're going to be after that from like just Jamaica and then branding out everywhere. I remember we were in the mall and then everyone just came up to you like QP, QP. I was like, I never knew you. Touch America, everywhere. I'm just proud of you. Happy birthday. I'm very happy to be here, to be celebrating with him. Rowan is a night owl and it's because from when he was a child, baby, I remember trying to put Rowan to sleep and Rowan put me to sleep. To me, Rowan is not only my nephew, but he's also a confidant and somebody he can talk to. And he'll give you his honest opinion. But happy birthday, I'm very proud of you and I love you very much. I've always said to myself, if you enjoy what you're doing, you never have to work a day in your life. Testimony to Rohan. And because of Rohan, I'm letting my sons pursue their dreams. I'll be there as backup, but I'm allowing them to do their dreams. Thank you, Rohan. Rohan, um, I wish you many more success and, you know, <laughs> live to see many more. All right. Yeah. I wish for you amazing things and everything that you wish for and that you will enjoy your 30s and your 40s and your 50s and God bless you, my brother. <laughs> oh, should I tell a story? Yeah, so uh, we started off at University of Technology 
And um, it was a group of us, and there was one day I couldn't find the group, so I saw him. You know, like, hey, friend. He was like, why are you talking to me? <laughs> you know, and we hold it together, you know, come and feel a little way. But then the group fell apart, so we're the only ones that remain friends. And, you know, to kind of saw me all the time, Uncle Perry, everybody. But, um, yeah, 10 years. <laughs> yeah. Sister. Sister. Yeah. Sister. Well, I love you. Oh. And I wish you many more years of success. And thank you for being my friend. So, I feel like everybody already knows me, but I'm Tananya. Um, the majority of Rohan and I's friendship, we've had it online. Um, I don't know, somewhere in the middle, we kind of fell apart, but I'm happy we found our way back because a lot of who I am now is because of you, my emotional maturity, the way I value people, my closeness to the Lord. When I met you at one of, well, I didn't meet you at that time, but we became close at one of the hardest parts of my life. I met you when I was in pieces and you helped pull me back together. I'm still not whole, but I'm finding my way there. And I just want you to know that you helped grew me, even when you didn't know that's what you were doing. Because I took everything you told me, everything you taught me. When, when your mother said, you are selfless and you give up yourself, she meant it. When I thought you turned your back on me, it was a blessing, you blessed me. You told me to go out into the world and do what I needed to do. Rowan, you don't know what you do for me. I can never, ever tell you thanks. I can never stop singing your praises. I don't want to hear who wants to say. I walk and call your name. I walk and call your name from now till God take my breath. Rowan, I tell everybody say you. I don't care. You deserve it. Every single thing good that happens to you you deserve it you are great i'm always tell you i am happy you decided to take me on the journey with you me never regret it one day no make nobody tell you otherwise i love you 30 look good for you <laughs> Happy birthday. I'm a woman did it for 30 and 30 and 30 and 30. Thank you, Lyle. <laughs> You've been your authentic self, and I just want you to continue being that. Continue being you, continue growing, continue achieving all your dreams. And I wish you nothing but the best, more love, more happiness, more success. And can't see the rest here, but continue being you, continue being, I wish you all the love and happiness. Um. Here's to more, and I hope I can be here more for you. Love God, I never mean for bad, you know. I promise you, I promise you. You are a beacon of light. I really appreciate all that you do and continue to do, all that you are and you continue to be. You are an, a phenomenal human being. Phenomenal. I'm getting goosebumps just talking about it. You're a phenomenal human being. And you've gotten this far because you've been authentically you, Rohan. Because I've known you before, the cameras, the fame and all of that stuff. This is the same <laughs> you. You know, we're just a little healthier. We have a little body now, you know? Not as hungry as one time. We're not as hungry as one time. But just continue to be you. And thank you so much. Thank you so much for inviting me into this beautiful family. I'm so grateful for you. Happy birthday. I hope you live to see many, many, many more. Love you.
I applaud his commitment to his job, his professionalism, his love for his family. He is a giving soul. Sometimes he tries to act like things don't bother him. But we at the table know his heart. You understand? So we have to protect that, you know? When Casey spoke about us being a family, what we try to do with our team is we bring people in that is recommended. And he spoke, like Casey said, so highly. We didn't really know Casey. We knew of Casey because, you know, she's a celebrity. You know what I'm saying? So we did, but we didn't know her. You are a girl. Anyways, we didn't know her, but he spoke so highly of her. And he did the same thing with the newest member of our team, Chad. Hi. Hi. <laughs> and spoke very highly of him. So I guess what I want to say is that for your 30th year and for every year of your life, I ask that God continues to walk beside you, guide your path, put an angel on your shoulder, and whisper voices in your ear. I want you to know that you are loved and understand it's okay to say no and walk away. It's okay to, I won't use the word selfish, but have self-love. You know, I love you, I appreciate you, and I'm extremely proud of you. Thank you for allowing me to be a part of your life. Good evening, everyone. Hello, my name is Chloe. Um, I am the daughter of Karen Clark and the god sister, <laughs> we'll call it that, the non-biological sister of Rowan. That wasn't without a fight, though. Somebody hit me. Yeah, actually. Be real about it. <laughs> wow. I didn't hate it. I never hated him. Um, <laughs> you didn't like him, though. I did not dislike him. That's not true. Let me give you context, guys. <laughs> That's not true. Um, I am nervous that the apple doesn't fall far from the tree, and I fear that I will not be able to encapsulate my love for you in words, but I'll try my best. Um, I met Rowan, obviously, through her, and I'm an only child, and my mom and I are all we have. So, you know, she has a lot of people that take to her, and she takes under her wing, and Rowan was another one, but this one wasn't leaving. <laughs> 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 so I was like, <laughs> so I was like, oh, I mean, <laughs> hi, I mean, you're, why are you still here? <laughs> Mom, why is he, why does he have a, a blown up picture in your office, I, of you together, like I don't understand, why is he, why is he, he gave me the picture for context, he gave me a picture of, he and I together for my office that was blown up and Chloe was like... It was giant. It was literally like this big. And I was like, um... um and then, you know, he would write things on, the, on Facebook and I'd be like, remember whose blood though? Remember whose blood? But um, no, I for real, I always loved Rowan. Always loved him. Um, it's, he's hard not to love. That's so true. He's very hard not to love. You can't fight it. And... Um, We've grown closer in recent years. We've always been, he's always been like a brother to me. Obviously I have no siblings, but he's always been like a brother to me. And these past few years, not happening. It's not happening. Oh my God. Okay. These. Oh my gosh, not cute. These past few years, um, he has become more vivid of a person to me in terms of just the details of who he is as a person. And I love him like more every day. And I'm really proud of him. I pray for you a lot. Like, I don't like when you're sad or like. Don't like when 
you're sad and I know that you put on like a brave face, but you're actually quite soft. <laughs> and you've always loved me for who I am and even the quirks when I wake you up in the morning against your will. And when I hug you and I'll be like, mom, he hugs me back now. <laughs> because I know you're not like a physical person. But um, I just wish the best for you 100%. And all of the things that make you you, I pray that you stay close to the source, which is God, because this world can make you hard. Not everyone will appreciate you for who you are. And that's just a reality. But you should never let your heart grow hard. Be the same soft person that you are, same loving person, selfless person, kind person, because that's what the world needs, that's what people need, and it bleeds into other people's lives. And that's what we're here to do, is love other people. And, you know, I know you have so much plans because you never stop. And many are the plans in a man's heart, but the Lord establishes his steps. So, I just pray that you continue to grow. Grow in your professionalism, your love, your friendships, everything, your opportunities, your spirituality, everything. I just want the best for you. Just know I'm always here for you. I know you're always here for people, but I'm always here for you. You don't have to say, Mina, look with me, because oh you know, sometimes y'all yeah, look. <laughs> <laughs> so um, that's all I have to say. I hope this shows you how much I love you. I think I like you, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, I'm that's it. <laughs> yeah, I'm coming around. <laughs> For those who don't know, my name is Chad, and like Drew, I'm probably the freshest one at the table. I met Perry at a really crucial, all right, let me not feel emotional. I went after two emotional ones, hold on. So I met Perry at a really crucial part in my life last year where I lost all my friends from high school and I thought it was the end of the world. And I met Perry and I realized how much it wasn't the end of the world and that there were so many more amazing people to meet on my journey of life. I met Perry when I first took this step to start creating content and making videos. And it was a hard time because it was in that stage where nobody knew if it made sense yet. So it was stupid until it, everything's stupid until it makes sense. And it wasn't making sense yet, so I was in the part where I looked stupid. <laughs> and Perry showed me that it wasn't something that it wasn't just some stupid hobby I had or something that I was trying to do. And he showed me that. Oh, you can go ahead. No, hold on. Give me a second to like. <laughs> so. Perry gave me an opportunity and showed me that my dreams aren't something that are humorous and they're stuff that can be accomplished. So I want to thank you for all the times you've given me that extra push where I feel like I'm not going to make it through or those times where I feel like I really just need somebody to just listen. Because you know I love to chat, but I don't. <laughs> It, when you love to chat, you don't know when someone's genuinely hearing you and feeling what you're feeling. And I want to thank you for that because I've always felt when I speak to you that I have someone that's listening and I have someone that's looking out for my best interest. So here's to 30 years and here's to 1900,000 more. Yeah. 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 Good night, everybody. Hi. How oh, you guys have been enjoying the weekend? Hope you guys have been enjoying. I've been enjoying myself, for sure, for sure. I didn't expect it, but you know. Um, I would like to read the first message email I sent to Quiet Perry, Rohan Perry, on the 24th of May, 2020. Good day, Mr. Perry. My name is Sing Zuma, and I'm an upcoming YouTuber growing relatively quickly on the platform. I see that you're currently putting YouTubers in your description, and I'm requesting to have my channel displayed there. Please let me know if it is or isn't possible. Thanks in advance. Yes, truly, Sing Zuma. And can I tell you, 
this man respond? <laughs> like, for somebody who is so big and who is so, you know, the personality that he is, you wouldn't expect him to respond to the little things. And um, I think he has taken me under his wing as a little brother, as a best friend. Um, I brought him outside, he has brought me inside. <laughs> We've been through so much, multiple ups, multiple downs, multiple downs. Multiple downs. <laughs> <laughs> he has helped me through the most. Um, I've had some foolish ways, I'm young, I'm living, I'm learning. Um, but he's a guiding force. And I'd just like to tell you, I appreciate you for everything that you've done in the past year and beyond. Um, I wish the best for you. And I know you wish the best for me. <laughs> and it's crazy how similar we are, bro. <laughs> so many things have come up where we're like, oh, you did this too? Right. You did this too? Right. <laughs> no, no, I'm <laughs> I'm not frozen, bro. I'm not frozen. Ooh. But uh, thank you for being there for me. Thank you for supporting me. And one thing that has stuck with me that I know that you share, that we share in common, that you mentioned to me, is I want everybody to listen very carefully. A quote that we share that we didn't know about before is to change the world by being yourself, bro. <laughs> Channel! <laughs> bro, like, <laughs> Not for real, like. <laughs> change the world by being yourself. Um, and I would like you to continue being yourself and changing lives. And thank you for the support, bro, right. outside. Yeah. And all <laughs> Thank you so much for being there for me. Toast to Rohan, Quiet Perry, Don P, Uncle P, everything. Don P. Coming. Um, thank you for being present. Thank you for actually spending the money I come. Right. Big up everybody who's flying. Yeah. Right. Big up all the travelers. Travelers, raise your hands. Yeah. Um, um, I've never really like celebrated like a like me made a decision to like celebrate my birthday myself. Um, I'm not sure if I keep on next one again, um, but I'm very happy that I did it. Thank you for the encouragement for actually, should not, should not focus, right? Thank you for the encouragement for actually, you know, encouraging me to do this. Um, I'm very happy I did it. Um, I'm very happy I got to celebrate with you guys. Um, it was more than I expected. Um, I just want to publicly thank you, as in the case, the double case, for all that you guys have done in terms of putting this together, um, especially in terms of the details, the back and forth, 
Right. Right. But at the end of the day, um, just want to thank you all for coming. And I love each and every single one of y'all. When I think of Rohan, the first thing that comes to my mind is his love, his laughter, which is highly contagious, and his beauty both out and in. When I think of Rohan, the first thing that comes to my mind is honesty with a laugh. Rohan is all about fun. Enjoy yourself. <laughs> Rohan is fun, Rohan is laughter. He, he, I think he's my favorite grandson. And, and Zane, this has been going on for years, for, so, for some time, yes, yes. and not as, not as much as before. He, he's my favorite grandson, and I wish him all the best. He, is, he, is, he has manners, and he is a very loving young man, and I wish for him God's blessings and all the best. Is that, is that good, you know? Rohan, I went, I went to Google for this one, ecstatic. You always like put a smile on people's face, like it's always exciting when you hear Rohan prayer, quiet prayer, yeah. That's what I would say. Um, all your cookie, yeah. It's always on your head, having fun, making jokes. The first word when I think of when I hear Rohan, it's not even a word, it's a statement. I just hear Manala. laugh. For some reason, that's all I can think of. Mana laugh, mana laugh. That's all I can think of. Is that weird? What's one thing that surprises me about Rohan? How chill he can be sometimes. I feel like persons don't get to see that side of him where he's just relaxed, in relaxed mode, in his comfort zone. You know, when I see movie nights and all of that stuff. Yes, yes. I think it takes a long, long time of day now. She's so rude. Oh my God, this is my time right now. <laughs> like, can you excuse me? <laughs> Anyways, it was great chatting with you guys. I guess my time's up. I guess we can go ahead to Chloe. Bye. Love you <laughs> The first thing that comes to mind is particular. <laughs> He's very particular in the sense that he likes things to be a certain way. He's very neat, very clean. Um, very de into details, so I think the first thing that comes to mind is particular, so, yeah. What would they be surprised to know about him? He is extremely thoughtful. Like, I feel like people probably know that in a general sense, but if you're close to him or you know him, you know he's very, very giving and very, very thoughtful. He's really like, he's a soft guy. Don't let him fool you. Okay. He's very soft, very loving. So that's something you'd like to know. One thing that about Rowan that most people would not know is that he is shy. Um, he's a shy person. He doesn't, you know, he's outgoing and loves life and all of that, but he's, a, he's shy and he's very giving. 
very loving, um, and he has a very strong relationship with the Lord. It's not a it's not a facade. He prays like he could preach, kind of prayer. Damn, <laughs> there's so many things. Personally, I think of him as a big brother, especially because we're in the same industry and I'm so many years behind him. Um, I think he's been a, a, a guide and more of a like, a real support system in the field that I'm in. Um, so QP, Quiet Perry, Rohan Perry. First thing that comes to mind, big brother, he's in the outside, we're not going. Um, I feel like he's the older one who's just like introverts and I'm just like, yo bro, what, what are you doing this weekend? Let's go. Side, you see me? QP, more like a dad of the group in terms yeah, of, stop. <laughs> in terms of like ensuring everyone everybody's safety good, yeah, and health wise. Sure. In terms of especially in COVID, he's making sure everybody taking their pills. If you're outside, make sure you take these vitamin C's. Sanitize. Yeah, so he's more of like he's the dad of the group for sure. You know, making yeah. sure that you're on the right path and doing what you're supposed to do not getting in the wrong crowd and those stuff. And, For sure. You know, ensure that you do what you have to do because everyone wants to make it in life and everyone needs someone as a support, support system, system to yeah. guide them and show them what's right from wrong and just educate them and just motivate them and so forth. So, yeah. It's the brains for me. <laughs> you got QP for real though. Like, yo, he's so nice. He's such a big person. Like, yeah. He's physically big, but like his heart is very kind. He's a yeah, very yeah, kind-hearted right. person. And I don't think a lot of people realize that because you just see him in person be like, oh, yo, that's QP and he's so big. But then like really and truly, his heart is very soft and he's a yeah, very yeah. kind person. And my person is my look on like outside my thing. Oh, as an influencer, he's my... Oh, I don't know. So nah. He's someone that's actually cool and if he sees something wrong, or he's going he, to ask. Or some way he can help, help. you. Or he's going some to. advice he can say to you, he's going to be that person to say it and say, yo, he's that guy. I think you should, you know, do this. Step I, back. Uh, yeah, step back. <laughs> you know? know? Figure out the crowd and ensure that you, you know, know I think I think wrong. I think the best way to describe it, he's a voice of reason. And yeah, I don't exactly. think a lot of people realize that. Even though he's a big personality and when he steps into a room, he's that guy. But outside of that, when he comes to somebody, he's like, he's the voice of reason. If you want something to talk about, he's the person to talk. Like, honestly, if you're like, you're not, sh you're thinking about something, you're not sure the right, the right way to, the right go, way to go about it or the right decision the that to you to. want to take. He's someone that's there that you can talk to and he'll give you that motivation, advice and support just to. Why don't I use my dog still? Yeah. Is he even big up? Mm -hmm. Laughter. Joy. Charisma. Yes, um, just a good time. Just, it's a feeling yeah. when I'm with him that just, it's like a drug. <laughs> it's like I want more. Like I just love spending time with him. So yeah. yeah. You just know it's going to be a good vibe. You know, it's going to be a good time. And mm -hmm. it's like, ah, all right. You it's going to work out one way or another. Mm -hmm. That his personality is not an act. Like he's yeah. this, he's a figurehead. Like people know him for this type of, personality and charisma and behind without the cameras and behind closed doors like on just FaceTime. This is really who this, this is really yeah. who he is. <laughs> and true. I don't know if people really get that. That's, um my own would be that he's a good listener. Seeing that people are always watching him talk, you'd probably think that he's just always on the go and always talking, but Perry's actually somebody who can actually sit down, listen and give you advice that you know in your heart is in yeah. your, your best interest. Oh, is that it? All done? Oh, my nerve was bad. He is so funny, but he's so caring too, but funny, but extremely caring. Like, he doesn't even know it that he's looking out for people, but um, he's just always there to listen. Oh, I'm always listening to him as well, but he is extremely caring, extremely thoughtful, and I, I appreciate him. That is the first thing that comes to mind when I think of Ryan. He's funny. Like the simplest things, we could be doing nothing at all and he's, he'll say something that will just, like have you looking at him a certain way, but still you're still laughing about it in your head. So he's, he's always that person. And like, I'm very shy and he'll, he's always that person who will get me to be more outgoing. Like myself, he's shy. I feel like he's someone who, when he's out, he'll 
be that outgoing person but when the crowd is gone he's kind of you know yeah he's very chill and a lot of people might not know that about him because he's so out there the first one that comes to my mind he's very he knows what he wants and he doesn't put up with anything that goes against what he really wants hilarious yeah you're super funny you know it's just always a good it's always good vibes around you literally crack me up all day long yeah so that was the first thing to do i seem like you're an extrovert but you really are an introvert introvert and when you're ready you really just don't want to deal with people you just <laughs> And that's, and that's okay. Sometimes you just need you know, time to relax and be alone. And yeah, you're getting old. And I think as we're getting older, we just realize that we really do enjoy our company more. So I appreciate that. Yeah. When I think of Rowan, and I think I just said the word, I think visionary. He, he has a plan and he sticks to the plan. He goes everything step by step. And I, I like that. So I, I would say visionary. Oh. Neat. Yes, he, he is that kind of meticulous little man who always had things in place, you know, and everything in its place and, you know. And then that, that kind of um, humor, humor, sense of humor kind of thing, yeah. He's, he's particularly shy. That much I know. Um, I'm surprised to see him in the field that he is. But then once he gets going, then that's it. But he has always been a shy kid. Yeah. The first word that comes to mind when I think of Ron is happy. I only have fond memories and good memories when I think of him. I've always smiled when I've seen him or when I've heard his name. I've always told him that I really appreciate him for bringing me along on this journey called life with him because since I met him, I have only gotten good vibes, I've only gotten positive energy, I've only become a better person. So definitely happy, definitely positive. He is really close to his emotions in terms of you might think something doesn't hurt him because of the way he looks on the outside, but he's actually feeling it and maybe feeling it even more than you are. and. I've learned that as I've said and I have realized that if something is wrong or if something is right you should say it just because he is very in tune with what is going on and you kind of want to be there with him and I've learned that and now I want to be there with him in all emotions good bad angry sad just because you know it's an experience and it's something that we grow and we learn. Oh, 
It's a movie. They should be on Netflix. That's all I gotta say. That's the one word. Anyway. Movie, movie, movie. That's the word. Uh, okay. I'd use heartwarming. I'm glad he was really happy. Fantastic. Mm. Word I would use to describe this weekend is lit. But I'm gonna go with my favorite. Oh. <laughs> It was inspirational for me. Fulfilling. It's going to be amazing. I'm just glad to be here. Fantabulous. Stupendous. Bashman. Everything. Good <laughs> Thank you. Yellow money. Yellow money. What a righteous man. A righteous man. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. No, man. First day I'm turning to my head. You don't lick me. I don't know if that's over here. I can't refund the age. Me? But I got back for 29. But I got back for real, man. Wait, so. Good morning. I'm going to look at you. You think so? You just have to open the door and sign it. been a joy it's definitely been a joy I'm very happy that everyone was able to make it all the people who were important to me in my life um, I'm very happy that I did this experience um, I'm happy that it's recorded and it will be in the public space of consumption so not only you can get to enjoy it but I can also get to enjoy it you know, years from now, just looking back at the awesome memories that we were able to create over the weekend. Um, I really hope that, I really hope that you guys enjoyed this and felt the love as much as I did. And my heart is just full, you know? Gratitude, very thankful. Um, so I wanna thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I know the strips already. Follow me on our social media at Quiet Perry. And of course, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Okay? Bye.